You've just been part of a moment of history there, presenting shirts to the, the first ever Vikings women's team. It's great to see how much it meant to the girls to join the club, wasn't it? Oh, it was uh, probably more of an honour for myself. Like you said, it's the first women's team and um, to have them represent the club as, as we do and to be the first women's team, it's, it's a special moment for them and, and their families and especially the club. And I wish them well and, and I know they're going to they're, they're gonna do good. For them this weekend, it's their first chance to wear Vikings colours. What was it like for you when you first put the Vikings shirt on? Yeah, it was... Uh, it was, a, it was obviously one of those moments, like sort of like my NRL debut, like my Super League debut, just like any any big moment in my in my career. It, was, um, it wasn't just a jersey that I was going to chuck on my back and, and and play rugby league. It was it was the people who come before me, the people after me, the people in the stands, my family. Um, special moment. So I know the the girls will 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 have that feel in the dressing rooms before they they run out this weekend and. Like I said, I wish them well and I, I know they're going to perform. Finally, Chris, go ask you, how, how have you coming on since the injury? How's everything going? Yeah, it's been a week since I've had the op, so I'm happy to be rolling around in my scooter. <laughs> uh, anything beats crutches. So. Should we zoom out and show the, the view, is it? <laughs> yeah, my little, my little toy. <laughs> <laughs> nice, we'll look forward to seeing you back on the field next Cheers, year. Cheers, thank, thank you. you.